If you don't subscribe in the next three seconds, I'm gonna lock you in the basement with my uncle and do bad things. So please, subscribe. And if you don't have a basement, consider yourself lucky. Yo, what did I say? What did I say? I don't know, I said something like I'm gonna upload video small consistently yeah anyways i'm back with another fps increase video and i know you guys have been waiting for this i know i know i'm gonna make other videos apart from this and i don't know probably the channel is gonna die anyways this is another fps increase guide prepared by me so yeah blitz let's get into the video now for the first step of course everybody knows we need good launch options if you want to get good frames when you play your game so this is one of the main things you must do when you play csgo so i've provided the launch options in the description so just open up your steam right click your csgo click on properties and then just paste all the launch options which i've given in the description so yeah this is the main first step. Now let's go to the next step. Now for the next step, we're gonna change some computer settings so that we can optimize our PC to run the games better. So first, you wanna go to start and type in background apps. Go there and make sure this let apps run in the background should be disabled. Now go to general, make sure you disable all this go to speech make sure that's off go to inking make sure that's off location can be turned off as well now notifications you can turn off the notifications something's gonna happen even if you uh, disable the notifications it's just gonna make your PC less laggier so yeah that's it now you want to go and type in game mode settings, open it up and make sure your game mode is enabled. Go to your Xbox game bar and make sure that is turned off. So yeah, now let's move on to the next step. Now for the next step, you have to create the ultimate performance power plan, which is a power plan which can help you get much better frames in your game, especially if you're playing on a low end PC. So for that, you want to go to start right click go to windows powershell admin and i've given the ultimate performance power plan the command in the description just copy that and then paste it just click on enter so as you can see ultimate performance power plan has been created so now go to start and then type in edit power plan go to power options and yeah I already have this power plan in my power options so if you can't see this ultimate performance just click on show additional plans and yeah just click on ultimate performance so yeah that's it so this can really help you get much better frames when you're playing your game especially it can help you get rid of those FPS drops by optimizing your PC for gaming and yeah so you have to do this step so yeah you, you definitely have to do this step if you want to get those fps potential in your game so yeah that's it now let's go to the next step now in the next step you want to open up file explorer and go to the drive where you install csgo go to program files steam steam apps common and click on Counter-Strike Global Offensive and then right click your CSGO, click on properties, go to compatibility and then make sure you disable full screen optimizations. Then click on change high DPI settings and make sure you enable override high DPI scaling, click on OK and yeah, click on OK. Now you want to go back to Steam. Now from here you want to go to user data then just find your account if you have multiple of these numbers just find your account mine is the first one so I'm just going to click on that go to 730 local CFG and then I've given the auto exec files 
download link in the description just download those files and then right click and paste them here just paste them and yeah it should be good now you can close it and let's go to the next step now like in every other game you need good settings in game if you want to get maximum fps while you play your game so for this you want to open up csgo go to the video settings and then yeah just copy all my settings make sure the aspect ratio is 4 is to 3 resolution can be 800 into 600 i use this to get better frames in game and yeah uh, the advanced video settings make sure everything is low and disabled except for multi-core rendering make sure that is enabled but now here's a setting which i even talked about in my previous video and that is the vertical zinc so what vertical zinc does is it locks your fps at the average fps you're getting in your game which helps you get stable frames now normally turning off or disabling the vertical zinc is better if you want to get maximum fps in your game but if you experience a lot of fps drops turning on vsync is a good option you can go for double buffered or triple buffered go for the one which suits you best so yeah that's it now in my previous video i've talked about set affinity and how to do this so basically after you open up csgo you want to go back to your desktop right click click on task manager right click your csgo click on go to details right click set affinity and click on cpu zero click on ok now along with this you can also do this right click your csgo click on set priority and make sure it's set on high and yeah you can close it so you can also do this to get better frames in your game and the set affinity can help you get rid of the fps drops which you get in your game so yeah it may work for you but it may not but still you can try this and if it works then yeah it's good so yeah let's go to the next step now the next step is mainly for the laptop users so if you use a laptop for playing csgo then you want to make sure you plug in your laptop whenever you're playing any game so plugging in your laptop while you play your game gives you much much and i mean much higher frames than when you don't plug in your pcs i mean laptop so for me i i used to get so much fps drops and my game used to lag a lot and when i checked why this was it's because i didn't plug in my pc i mean why am i saying pc laptop while i was playing csgo so yeah so after i plugged in my laptop i got much higher frames trust me guys you guys need to plug in your pc oh my god you guys need to plug in your laptop whenever you're playing your game so yeah this is one step all the laptop users must do it is a must do for all the laptop users so yeah that's that and let's go to the next step so yeah guys the final step is the most important step so all you have to do is to head over to my channel and spank that subscribe button and enable the notifications to get all the updates so yeah adios mis amigos hola mis amis i'm going to end the video here piss off